Okay, well, I'll try this again. I've tried to record this video three times. I'm going to try this again, though. Third time's a charm, they say. This will be the third attempt, actually. I've, I've actually already tried to record it two times, not three times. So I, I exaggerate it, but still, this is the third attempt, so we'll see. Um, I'm going to put a padlock on the um, back doors of that, uh, of, of this box, of, of this cap. And the reason I'm going to do that is because I'm always concerned that the rear doors may pop open at some point. I don't have a lot of faith in the locks that are in the lock that's actually there on those doors, on the latch. And, you know, a propane cylinder could roll out and, you know, end up causing an accident on the highway. A car following me could hit it or something. And also, um... When I'm carrying anything of any value in there, too, I don't really want for... If I'm parked in a public place, with a parking lot or on the street or whatever, I don't want people just being able to open the doors and, and take what they want. It's a fairly light latch, so I'm concerned about it opening up. You know, if they opened up, a tank like that could hit the road, and if there was somebody tailgating me or whatever, they could end up having an issue. You know, it could cause an accident. There's a lot of room in here. As you can see, it's a fair, there's a fair amount of room. Of course, it came with this shelving unit. Um, I don't know if I'll be keeping that or not. It'll depend. If I have to live in the thing, then I'll probably be taking that out. And I'll probably be cutting this, too. Cutting this back, because this takes up a lot of room. And as you can see, it's already open in the back, so it's kind of a useless thing. The only thing is, it looks like here... You see all this wiring here. Um, if you look here, inside here you can see there's a plug. Okay, oh, there we go. <laughs> there's a plug there, like a 120 volt plug. So I'm thinking this may be connected, hooked up to accommodate a generator. Or it may be, huh, I just noticed this here too. I don't know what this is about. Anyway, it may be connected to accommodate a generator. Uh, that's actually a starter button there. That's what that is. I have no clue. Maybe that's to start a generator. I have no idea. Maybe there was a generator in here at one time. Maybe there even still is one hidden somewhere underneath all this mess. I don't know, but anyway, um, it's possible that there was a generator in here, or there may be a voltage inverter. That might be what's what's powering that plug. So I want to trace the wiring. I want to see where the wiring goes eventually before I mess with it too much. But basically my plan is just to eliminate this because it'll open up the space. It'll give me more room because this is kind of a wasted space really in here. So, yeah, as it is. But, uh, this one here I'll keep because I can I want to get that rekeyed though get the lock on this one rekeyed but this one I'll keep because I can um I can you see there's a lot of room in there I can store tools in there and stuff so I'll keep it probably I could keep my chainsaw in here and I could keep my um uh I could keep my uh battery powered saw a little saw that I have I could keep all that in there anyway let's put the lock on the door it just depends if I'm going to be living in this thing then um, I'm going to have to make some modifications to it uh, whether I'll be living in it or not I really do want to get rid of this because it's taken up a lot of my room you know it'll open the space up nicely if I cut it right back to there then I'll have all this open so that's likely what I'll do either way. And whether I get rid of this or not just depends what use I'll be putting this cap to. If I'm going to use it for working, I'll keep this. Um, in fact, uh, I'll have to figure it out, but I'm sure I'll figure things out in such a way that I'll be able to keep this if, I, if I'm going to use the, the cap for, for work. But um, yeah, we'll see. If not, then I'll store this away, or maybe I'll sell it. I've seen them up for sale, 
these these um, shelving units for vans so I may sell it I don't know yet but I'd like to keep it you can see though I'm just concerned that this door may pop open at some point I want to get this lock rekeyed too but um, this will be a little bit better just to keep it from the, oh, there we go yeah, see, putting that on there, now it can't come open. Look at that, even no matter what I do, I that, that can't come open now, even if that pops open. So that's the idea, anyway. And then I've got the key here. To, uh, key here to, to open it up. Yeah, if I want to open it, I can just open it. And, yeah. Now, that's the plan. There we go. It may rattle and bang a little bit, but that won't matter. I've been recharging my power banks in here, too. So that's a good thing, too, I guess. Oh, just look in here and see. Some scrapes there and stuff. Oh. Alright. Anyway, that's it for now. We'll talk to you later.